This, this song is called simply the sun. Oh, the Lord gave me five daughters. I'm blessed they're all alive. But a boy thrown in the mix somewhere would have been just fine. I found comfort through the years as I hoped and prayed that my girls would come through and bring home a son-in-law one day. He'd be tall, he'd be good-looking, so my grandkids would be too. He'd be brave and he'd be smart, but not afraid to share at you. We'd hunt and fish and cuss and spit and talk football all the time. Yeah, a son-in-law for a buddy is what I had in mind. Not long ago, my middle girl told me that she had found the one. I began my celebration. I would finally get my son, but I know I must have peed my pants because it really rocked my world when she said the name was Becky, and Becky was a girl. <laughs> well, in these days of diversity, I didn't know who she'd bring home. I was thinking maybe Phil or Shane or even Pablo or Tyrone. She said the girl was special. She was courteous and kind. But the son in law named Becky ain't what I had in mind. <laughs> Now this is where the story gets weird. I know you think it already did. But now my son-in-law, Becky, wants me to be the father of her kid. It seems a child with both family's genes be their pride and joy. And I guess I'll go along with it. Hey, maybe it'll be a boy. <laughs> Now, in these days of diversity, didn't know who she'd bring home. But I was thinking that you feel a shame, or even Pablo or Tyrone. Don't get me wrong, we love the girl. She can talk football just fine. But a son-in-law named Becky ain't what I had in mind. No, a son-in-law named Becky 